Holy crap, that chapter title hit me quick. Hey guys, <laughs> what's up? It's me, Chris Cube here. And Able Gamer. And we are back for more Portal 2. The Yay. Escape. Well okay, Maybe it's the Great Escape? Is it just a regular escape? Who knows? Um, I don't know. I don't know. By the way, why. it doesn't I don't matter. Know why. Oh, sorry. It, it doesn't matter if you which, if you keep going which way. Uh, I could run forever this way. Uh, going forward, I'm holding down the W button. It will always go right here when he turns on the light. Okay. But um, when you when you said the Great Escape, I don't know why, but I thought of um the Great Cave Offensive from Kirby Superstar. Oh, I thought of Stitch's Great Escape ride from Disney World. Oh, I haven't been there since my birthday. When oh, was that? Oh yeah, March. <laughs> when was your birthday again? Oh yeah, it's March. I keep forgetting. This part you can easily die on because those things, those two arms there will push you out of the way. How many times have I died now? Twice? Yeah. Those arms will push you off. Like right here. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. I didn't I forgot I did not know that they could hurt you. Well, I mean they are lasers. Shut up. But uh guess who the foreman went with? Only, Only an exact duplicate of himself. Ended up giving me the worst, worst job. job tending to all the smelly humans. humans. The, the, uh, oh, make that three. Smelly. <laughs> well, there we go. That's what I get for saying that he was attending to all the smelly humans. I almost got a job a job done here, almost manufacturing. Got a job down here in manufacturing. But uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself, a nepotism. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the. Are you kidding me? The, the, what? Um, sorry. That oh. <laughs> <laughs> I I wasn't paying attention. That's why I was like, "What?" I am hanging my head in shame. You died how many times? Three times. Three times total. I'm just a lot more careless. Only, but that's you know hurting me now. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the okay. smelly humans. The, the, um, there we are. Smelly. Just, just tending to the humans. Sorry, yeah, uh, you already made your mistake. I hate you. Goodbye. The smelly humans. Okay, there's another wall over here. I know. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans. humans. Oh, love love them. <laughs> Here is where you can see the turrets being built. And there we go. Geronimo! You can actually die at this part, so be careful. I know I can. but I was warning the viewers, not necessarily you, because I know you know what you're doing. Oh, yeah. Well... I mean, do we ever know what we're doing? You can come down here and land here on your first go, but I slipped. But, you know You what? slipped. At least you didn't slip and die. That's a plus. <laughs> At least you didn't get a fifth death. Yeah. I, uh, uh it, it, the, the other, de my excuse for the other deaths was that, I, or in the other playthrough was that I was reckless and tired. Here, I'm just reckless. It had nothing to do with you being tired at this point. Nope. Because I'm not tired. Well, my eyes want to... Well, my eyes actually are not that bad. Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Turret redemption lines are not right. Uh, uh, <clears throat> was it this line. one or the other one that I'm thinking... Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm, yeah. It's... Son of a mother. This is where you died, actually. Yeah. Yeah, this is this was the point where I that died my first little, time. That little ledge right there, actually made for something pretty funny. Here, I'm gonna pick this guy up. You wanna wait and you wanna wait? Just listen. Prometheus was punished by the gods for giving the gift of knowledge 
to man. He was cast into the bowels of the earth and picked by birds. That I didn't know, and I don't think that dirt has ever said that. <clears throat> the answer is beneath us. Huh? Thought we just said don't look down. Her name is Carolyn. Who's? Play the pronoun game so that we don't know who you're talking about. Remember that. Hey, we don't have to tell the viewers. Holy crap. Alright. I think we're giving us that information. We should let this turret live. We shall. I'm going to... I'm going to preserve him. Her? Maybe? I don't it. know. I'm going, to, I'm going to preserve her right... I, I would try and, like, face it, like, toward... Uh, toward it, but I don't want to knock it over. There we go. Enjoy your life. Maybe somebody will come by and pick you up. Or not. That scared me. I thought the turret was shooting at me for a second, but I know it. It can't even do that. Target acquired. Oh, God. It will actually shoot you. Oh, Son God. of a mother! Thank God. If you're quick, I think you can do it, but I'd still just wait for a defective turret. That's what I tend to do. And here, just to speed things up, I already know what I have to do, so I'm just going to do it. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, and uh, like I said, because I already know what I'm what I need to do, I'm gonna speed things along and just do this. Almost there. Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. See that scanner right there, right? It's deciding which turret to keep. All we gotta do is wait for him to talk. And if you notice, there's a crack in his blue lens right there that wasn't there before uh, GLaDOS, you know, cracked him. So that we can get at it. Technical. Um, you'll need to turn around while I do this. Is that kind of like a don't ask, don't tell thing? Okay, come on, just pull that turret out. I actually don't know if you want to put that near it just because it might it might blow up. Good call. I, oh yeah, if you stand in that. Yeah, I know. I was gonna cover that. If you stand in there, there's an achievement and it scans you. It's like scan me or something. I forget. <laughs> so we're all supposed to be blind. It's not just me. All right, fantastic. I like that. Yeah, the, 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 the turret answers are pretty dang funny. Yes, yes, indeed. I don't understand. This is pretty funny. <laughs> Do what we get. Some, I mean, if you stay around at some points in this game, dialogue will just keep going, and it's hilarious. Was there any sort of announcement before it opened, like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind, or like a hacker alert? I mean, yeah, fair enough. The important thing is it's open, but it's just, in, it's just mentioned. Oh, in the future. and yet yeah, um, right. remember the 1.1 volts? So well, here's another thing to remember on top of that. As well. And uh, their ears just gonna have to remember a lot of things, and it'll all come down to one point in the game. Well. And <laughs> forty potato batteries. And then there's this. Kinda looks like GLaDOS a little bit, actually. I didn't notice that till now. Yeah, that's nice, I guess. At least you won't starve. Yeah, you'll be living off of starch and you'll be constipated. I mean, I like potatoes, but... As do I, but I couldn't eat them for every single meal. I guess you have lettuce and grass there, too, and that's edible, but... Okay, let's try this it's way. this way. Oh, it's not this way. Yep. All right. Time to deal with her neurotoxin. And I don't know if I talked about this before, but in the last game, you can see your portals through walls at, and at great distances to know where you put your portals. And in this game, you can in this game you can do that if you haven't guessed already. In the first game, you could not do that. It is quite helpful. Yes. 
More helpful than one would think, actually. One more Skittle. Well. One more Skittle for good measure. Actually, I have a ton of Skittles left in the bag. I should have said another Skittle. Oh. Ha! I knew we were going the right way. This is the neurotoxin generator. A bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not gonna be able to just, you know, push it over. Have to apply but, some cleverness. You know, it'll still There's be pretty easy. Room up at the top, so uh, let's go and investigate. Why they felt the need for two doors there, I'll never know. I should laugh, but they do feel pain of a sort. It's all simulated. But uh really not for them, I do feel pain. Great. Now you made me feel like a monster. No way to what are you doing? We don't know what that button on. Well done. Let's see what's it. <laughs> Good news. I can use this equipment to shut down the neurotoxin system. It is, however, password protected. Ah, alarm bells, no. Oh my god, do you remember this part? Yes. There was a really funny line here that neither of us noticed was in this game until that point in the until that playthrough, and it's hilarious. We died laughing when we found that out. Just listen. You might catch it, you might not. In case of implosion, look directly at implosion. That wasn't it, but that's still funny. Listen. Warning: Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. Dangerously unlethal. <laughs> I was gonna say, did you catch that? Because it said dangerously unlethal levels. And to speed things along, you can avoid this, but I'm just gonna go for it. Okay. And now we just have a really long cutscene where we do next to nothing. Well, I'm doing nothing anyway, so nothing new for me. We do next to nothing. You do next to nothing. I do next to nothing. Uh, excuse me, princess. Well, I guess I am the princess between me and old friend, so... You know, it, my brain hurts without you trying to confuse it with that anyway. <laughs> yeah. I think this is like the third time I've given him... I, I think this is the third time I've melted his brain. It's like that one uh, Jeff Dunham joke with uh, Baba J and... Um, and um, uh, they, they should make a roller coaster out of this. I would pay money to ride a roller coaster about this. But um, anyway, um, what was I saying? You were saying something about um stuff. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, what were we talking about? Stuff. Kyle, I, 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 why do you think I'm saying oh, that? Uh, third time I, you melted his, uh, third time you melted my brain. Uh, oh yeah, the Bubba J. Jeff Dunham joke. Okay. And my grandma, and my grandma swears I have ADD, and I don't believe her. But um, I, she, um, the 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 joke was it was during the Halloween special, and Bubba J. said um, and what, what was it? Bubba J. said. I can't count past six, so when I get it. Oh, okay. Oh, I, okay. So, so um, Bubba J says, okay. So, <clears throat> so um, Jeff Dunham asks, um, what's the highest you can, what's the highest you can count? Six. If I, every time I buy a twelve pack, I have to trust him. Why don't you just buy two six packs? <gasps> My brain hurts. That's, it's like I hurt my brain. That's what I feel like. And if you notice, this is exactly where we were when we went into this part and what found her dead or whatever she was. And now it's all built again. I guess she really went to work. GLaDOS emergency shutdown and cake dispenser. Cake! Proof that the cake is a lie! I knew it all along! Hi, Alan McLean. Long time no see. Um, I'm claustrophobic. This this is not good. I'm I'm claustrophobic. No, guys, I'm kidding. I'm not claustrophobic. And I'm sorry for those of you who are claustrophobic. I was not trying to make fun of you at all. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. Of course. I hope you brought something stronger, stronger than, than a portal, portal gun, gun this time. time. I'm gonna shut up now. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Ha uh ha. -huh. Ha uh ha. -huh. Seriously though, goodbye. It's my big chance. This is trouble. 
This is trouble. Again. Ah, this ain't good. You were busy back there. Yes, I was. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath. Actually, that's not a good idea because that will just cause you to breathe heavy, and that's not what you want to do in a case like this. Hello. I hate you so much. I love how she says that no so nonchalantly. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core says the government. To initiate a core transfer, please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Torch. Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Pull me out, pull Unless me a stalemate out. associate is present. Okay, I'll pull you out. Pull me out. Leave me in. Leave me in. Leave I'm not going to make a joke out of that because it is way too obvious. Yes, do do it. Not so fast. Yeah, it, 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 she does one of those things, but you know what? Screw you. Alright. And now we do nothing. Believe me, it will. Are you, are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just, no, you're not. You are, it is going to hurt, isn't it? Exactly how painful are we talking about? I don't know why it would hurt. Goodbye. Good riddance. And everything brightens up. Yay! We did it. I'm in control of the whole facility now. Whoa! Ho, ho. Would you look at this? Not too bad, eh? Giant robot. Massive. It's not just me right here. I am bloody massive. What I like about it is that now all that all those white parts are like moving in and out. Like you see, if you notice that. There we go. I can barely see you. And Very pick up glass. Oh, we can't do that. I knew it was going to be cool to be in charge of everything. But, wow, this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bloody genius now. Something about it being incorrect and a manual, please. I know little to no Spanish. <laughs> Uh, uh oh, that's not good. This isn't gonna turn out well. Come on, come on, just let us let us leave. Oh, uh, oh no. I was gonna say thank you all for watching the playthrough. I hope you enjoyed, but we can't exactly do that. I mean, this is what I mean by doing next to nothing. So I'm literally not touching anything except to move the mouse button or the, the mouse button, except to move the camera. What are you doing? Don't think I'm not onto you too, lady. You know what you are? Selfish. I'm selfish. But nothing but sacrifice to go. What sacrifices have you made? None. Zero. And to Only quote uh, Navy Blue over here, I died five times now. Four or five. Ah. You died twice in that section. That is a potato battery. It's a toy and... for children. Is that a four or five times? I think it's four. <laughs> potato battery. There we go. Sorry, potato. Uh, what's like before. Was in the voice of a British comedian? No. Apparently it was. No, you're lying. You're lying. I think this thing is something against Brits. Designed to be a moron. You know what that sounds like? Certain someone we know who I'm related to. Hmm? You know, <clears throat> engineered to be an idiot. Yeah, you know what that sounds like? <laughs> My brother. Could a moron do that? And we gotta end it here quickly. Wow!